Hey everyone, welcome back to Wee Blogs, another Eurovision 2024 reaction video. Oh my gosh, we almost have like 11 songs, 10 songs. It's crazy and it's amazing at the same time. I haven't heard all of them yet. Ooh, but I have to do that and today it's time to hear Malta. The singer is called Sara Bonici. Bonici, Kuprasheo, Cara. I, I love that name. I really love that name. <laughs> so her song is called Loop. Let's see if we are going to listen her song on loop, on replay. Deban, are you ready? Hey you guys! Let's, Let's do, do this! <laughs> Oh my gosh, literally after so many quarterfinals, semifinals and everything, Multi Eurovision Song Contest is over and Sara Bonici won. I think she won with a lot of points, like 22 points more than the second place. Total Sledge, Realness, Honey, come true! I saw like few clips with like 15 seconds and I loved what I saw and I can't wait to listen and watch the whole 3 minutes of her performance. You know that Sara Bonici is not new to the Malta Eurovision Song Contest in 2009. She came, I think she came 3rd or 2nd and then she was at the X Factor and now she is back and won the national final and she's going Going to Eurovision Song Contest finally, girl! Yes! That's how you slay. Oh my gosh, congratulations! And we are ready to listen her song, which is called Loop. Putting our AirPods Pro on so we can enjoy the music fully. Alright, I am hitting the. Oh, wow, wow. Oh. Is this oh. Gotcha! Okay, filming. Okay, okay, okay. Malta, Malta, Malta. Oh, I like that. It's you got effective. me so high. I feel like we are going to get so high during our reaction video. <laughs> oh, these dancers oh, are good. Dancers, these flexible dress. Climb those, man, honey. <laughs> oh, she's. A oh, the lights are good. Don't tell me you are my addiction, girl. You are our addiction. Ga ga ga. <laughs> Oh my god, it's amazing! Alright! It's so melodic. Mama, mama, mama. Oh, the dancers are loving, loving, loving. Okay, I love she. I love how she's dancing and singing at the same time. Yes, honey! Oh my gosh, the way she plays with the dancers. She's an actress as well. Oh yeah! Excellent movement, great lighting design. Move, 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 move! Come on, move, Sara! Bonici, Bonici! Oh yeah! Bring it in for 2024. Oh, do you hear the instrumentals? I love them. What? Blindfolding. Did you did you did you see that? The wheel. Oh and my sister's bag. got it Girl, going on. She's ready to make us blind. Okay, vocals. Come on. Alright. Uh, okay, she kinda missed that, but still. It Come was on. obvious. Here we go again. Daras, yeah. Oh! Ooh, come on, you have to just tap it. Hey. Oh, I'm not a death break, girl. Oh, she's like... Oh, wow. Oh, take her high. Take her high. Oh, she's like... Mm. Go away, boy. This is my stage. <laughs> okay. 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 Let me 
just start by saying that shout out to the island of Malta, a country with so much talent. I mean, Malta really, per capita, probably is probably one of the most talented countries on earth. There are just so many people that casually, they just know how to sing, they know how to dance, they know how to break it. But when you ask what they do, there's like, oh, I work in the bar or I work in a refrigerator company, or I do window installations. But you are a performer. I'm a doctor. I'm a doctor in a hospital. Malta has an all singing, all dancing medical team. Sarah Bonici is amazing. She can sing, she can dance. I mean like, you know, and there is so much working here for me. The lighting design is totally on fire. I like the way her wardrobe is really paired back. It's just giving me silhouettes of shape. Her, the dancers that she's flanked with, totally on point, particularly the sort of the, the staircase move they, um, they did at the very beginning of the song. I thought that was very effective and then flipped her to the side. But you know what? Yes, a few breathy hiccups, but by and large, vocally, she was on point. One missing ingredient though, where is the song? <laughs> because, you know, uh, I'm sorry, the song here is the weakest element. Performance wise, on fire. And many other auxiliary elements, which are part of the production. Yeah, everybody's got the brief, but ah, this is not really a song. This is not a song that you would play on the radio, but then Eurovision is also got a very strong visual component. And not only does she give us a dance off at the end, there was also a dance break. This is taking, this is Noah Carell, Eleni Ferreira and Chanel on steroids. Okay, wow, uh, Malta, Sara Bonici, Bonici you, you, Okay, we got few things to discuss here. First of all, I absolutely love the beginning, you know, the music live performance. It's so good. I mean, the, the filming, the shots, the camera shots. What? And then it's it kind of faded away, you know? I, I feel like she needs more, you know, kind of more like spectacular uh, staging. And, you know, like I would have loved to see some fire, some pyro, something like that. But it's a national, uh, you know, final performance. It's not, uh, you know, necessary uh, that much. But, oh my God, at Eurovision Girl, you better serve us those effects. She has the visuals. Uh, she is the visual, actually, and those dancers, oh my gosh, they are really, really talented. Vocally, you know, she has time to work on that. It's it's almost perfect, but you know, some places, uh, like the middle of the song, kind of on the floor, and, um, you know, serving some vocals, you ha she has to, you know, she has to be perfect on the vocal side. And also, a I need a little bit more energy, like much more energy than uh, this. And I think she can, she can definitely deliver that. She has time. She has so much time to kind of make it perfect, you know. And the song, I absolutely love, 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 love the song. Didn't they say they are going to revamp it or uh, like make it like bigger, bigger for Eurovision? I hope so because I, I feel like it's not 100% finished, you know, the song. But it's so catchy. I felt like I'm watching, I don't know, Pussica Dolls. When I grow up, what do I think, what do I start? And Sarah Bonici is like Nicole Scherzinger slaying, you know, in all way. Yes! I am absolutely here for it. In terms of Malta's qualification, whether this will advance, I think it is, yeah, it could advance, um, but it also may not advance. I mean, the, the, the voting in the semis is televote only, and this has a very strong televote appeal. Personally, I think this should go through. I think that there's several disciplines that she brings into, into this performance. Sarah has got very strong camera awareness. She exudes a level of confidence that is synonymous with the world's biggest pop stars today. And certainly in terms of movement, she is slaying. And not only is she moving, she's also singing. How many stars get besides Janet Jackson? Shout out to Janet Jackson. Shout out to Beyonce, shout out to Jennifer Lopez. Not many stars can actually do that. To sing and dance 
and have a sense of strong camera awareness at the same time. And you know what? We shouldn't overlook this fact. This is actually a very difficult cross-discipline. If you don't qualify this year, we got a problem. Last year they had really amazing staging at Eurovision and they didn't qualify. If this song, if this performance, if Sara Bonici doesn't qualify, I will be like, really? Really? <laughs> And can we talk about how gorgeous she is? I mean, she is literally playing with the camera so good. You know, looking at the cameras and playing her thing, you know, doing her thing, playing her game. I absolutely love that part where she and the dancers put a band on their eyes. It's so effective and the wheel, how can she rotate in that way? It's so crazy. I don't think we saw something like that at Eurovision, so it's a nice effect, Sarah. It's so catchy, come on, it's such a melodic song and um, I can't wait to have it on Spotify so I can add it on my Spotify playlist. <laughs> Not all the songs have emerged um, out of, um, you know, for Eurovision 2024, but at the moment I kind of feel like this is, this is a good talking point. I must admit, I'm not crazy about the song. It feels like an afterthought, but everything else is working for it. Having said that, Please do not do an Irolosco 2.0 and come up with another song. Let's just work with this. Let's just work with this. Is Sarah Bonici on Pinterest? She ought to be because what she's given me is more than just face, body, and moves. There's a whole lot more going on. Oh my gosh, she is so beautiful. I love her sense of assurance and she's got a beauty which is like... <laughs> out there to snatch waves. Love her. So thank you so much guys for watching this video. I hope you like it. Please don't forget to subscribe to our channel. We are editing so many videos for you, reaction videos. We are traveling through Europe to the national finals and the pre-parties are coming up. Oh my gosh, I can't wait. I hope to be able to go to some of them and see you all there, of course, and have a party. Let's make Eurovision 2024 the best Eurovision. Um, yeah, keep seeing, keep glowing. You are all amazing. Please follow me on Instagram. Sinan SDL, follow Deban on Instagram, Deban underscore Deban. And while you're at it, please follow WeWe Blogs on Pinterest, and we will see you later. Bye! Bye.